Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Insider Gamer. Welcome back to OMSI 2, obviously, and welcome to a, another Friday night CCS event here in the BCS company Simply Connect. Uh, today we're on West Country 3. There's quite a few of us actually on the event. I think there's about 14 or 15 of us, which is really, really good, good turnout. And today we will be in the BARLE, uh, which I have in a temporary repaint at the moment for Simply Connect. And uh, it needs to be tidied up and obviously the, the seating needs to be done, etc, etc. And it looks like the game may have just frozen on me at the same time. There we go. It's okay. All good. Uh, so yeah, so that's what we're up to today. There's quite a few of us. We've got Richard in the office for the first time, so be gentle to him. Uh, he is learning OMSI as he promised he would, so he's doing that. Uh, hello to everyone that is here in the chat. Leo, hello. Colin McKenzie, Daniela Long, Jordan Crawford, B.G. of course. Uh, Dylan Busbodding, hello. K13, Benny Wood, uh, Mike Gray, good evening. Uh, Commander and Anderson, hello. Transport Fan 2003, hello. Glenn Bixley, good morning. K13, hello. Jeff Rooney, hello. Hello to everyone else that might be there or just watching or lurking or any of the other things that you are doing. Hello. Okay, so uh, we actually are late now, I believe. I think we're supposed to leave at 11.22. Uh, if we just get onto the bus, because I can't actually remember. Yeah, we must be late now, look. Uh, it's about media. I'm driving the older brother right now. <laughs> okay, maybe I should turn on the ticket machine as well, hey? Okay, very quickly. We're going to leave a bit late, but there's plenty of time on this run. We are on the X35 first. Uh, so we are playing CCS. I can't choose my routes. My routes will be assigned to me. Uh, so whatever we get in the control room is what we're going to do. Uh, just making sure it is 11.22 I was leaving. It was, of course it was. Okay, let's just fix my cameras now very quickly. Thank you. Uh, we'll turn on some bus lights for the passengers. Okay, let's shut these doors. And let's get a, a wiggle on here. Oh, hang on, I need to turn the volume on for you guys. I don't have the volume on because they were talking in the CCS, but there we go. All is good now. Quebec bus and rail spot. Hello, good evening. Adrian Martinez, hello. I see you here. I know it's not quite your thing, the old buses, but hello, hello. Jordan Crawford on Facebook, hello, good evening. Hello to everybody. Yep, so, uh, oh, that's okay. Point of no return, we're all good. We haven't driven on West Country 3 in a little while, I think. So it's quite nice to do. Might need to turn the volumes up a little bit here. And uh, from the last stream, uh, I did mention that I didn't have any of the uh, human packs. So I wasn't sure about them. Uh, Chabs, I don't know if Chabs is there in the stream this evening. Thank you very much for donating quite a few uh, uh, people packs to me. Uh, it's very kind of you, very kind gesture. Uh, so thank you very much if you are watching, mate. Much, much appreciated. Uh, now, these buses are quiet. I'll turn it all the way up. There we go. Yeah, uh, but even in real life, these buses are extremely quiet. What routes will we be doing? Um, so basically, we're playing CCS, which is Control Center Simulator. Uh, so I don't get a choice. It's whatever the controller in the office. Uh, so we can have problems like, you know, we might need police, ambulance, uh, mechanics, all these kind of things. Um, hey, Johnny, is that the show now? There we go. That's going to be quite loud, guys. I do apologize. I'm just going to turn down Steven and volume a bit because they will be quite loud. There we go. So yeah, so I don't get a choice of the routes, unfortunately. Uh, Chung is go. Hello, X35. Yes, we're on the X35. We are in the B8. Uh, so we will be doing quite a bit of Yorkshire streaming this week, guys, just so you know. Uh, there will be quite a bit. Sunday we'll be flying. There'll be a group flight on Sunday, but we will be doing quite a bit of uh, Yorkshire streams next week to catch up with some of the bits that we're missing. Uh, there are some videos tomorrow and Sunday as well. Hello, lad. Hello. But look, we've got loads of different people now, which is pretty cool. Come on, Doris. You're in the way of everyone. Come on. Oh, uh, you don't do CCS. Yeah, yeah. Did West Country get updated? Looks a bit different since last time I played. I don't think so. Hello. Oh god. <laughs> it's a bit chilly on the old extremities in here, main. You really complaining? You really complaining? Okay. Let's uh, whack some heat up for them. We got nothing better to do these passengers but complain. Uh, the only thing that looks different is I got new humans. I don't know if that that might be it. Come on, car. 
Bloody Land Rover drivers. Or Range Rover drivers, same thing. Mike Gray, hello. How are you? I'm good, mate. I'm good. Uh, Transport Fan has can request what you want. Yeah, we can request what we want, um, but it depends if routes are already gone, because it, it's all about timing. Uh, so an event lasts for four hours. We started at seven. There's 14 other drivers driving on the map with me this evening. Uh, we're going to hear them when they have problems. Um, so if there's a route available, we'll, we'll take it. We'll, we'll just see what comes our way. You know, if we have to do a back tour. Oh, someone's got a problem already. Hello. Hello, Benny Woods. Hello. C can you give me the return trip? I certainly can. Wait a moment. 105 Sierra. Uh, there we are. Um, gonna have to give you the one afterwards. So, what we've got? 12. 12, what's that? So, 1127. Can you give me something uh, later? Yeah, I'm on it, I'm on it, I'm on it, don't worry. Uh, High Street to High Street to Memorial Crescent. Uh, Can you give you an X35 back? Is that okay? Mm hmm. There you go. Oh, hang on. Sorry. No, I can't. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. Sorry, that's my fault. Can you drive yourself? Do you know how to get to the, the trade estate? Okay. Drive there. There's, there's one starting at 11.50. Here you go. Drive to. All yours. Okay, thank you. Cheers, mate. Uh, Arjun, good evening. Uh, Kieran Brady, good evening. Aaron Brady, hello. Don't know if you're the same person. Uh, Mackenzie Winslow, hey, I've just done my second round this evening on 12. Nice, mate. Are you new with us? I, I don't recognise, obviously. Oh, it's Mac, is it? Uh, Glenn Bixley, Range Rover, four-wheel drive to shop, Land Cruiser, four-wheel for hunters. Not the same. Uh, absolutely the same in this country. Uh, they're used for two-mile shop runs, school runs uh, on great roads. <laughs> Kevin Graham, good evening. Who's in the office? We have Steve... Oh, crap. Uh, we have Stephen in the office at the moment, and then uh, Richard, the, the, the king of doom when it comes to OMSI, uh, will be doing an hour, and then I'm going to finish it up. Yeah, you got a new map, Gladback. Nice, Gladback's not a bad map. I quite like Gladback, it's not a bad map. Uh, Run for Transport, good evening. Hello, hello to everyone that is joining us. Good evening, good evening. Hello, hello. How are we all on this Friday evening? Yeah, no worries. It's because uh, I don't always recognize when people have their YouTube names up. Unless it's exactly the same. Yeah, good turnout again for a CCS event, which is really, really good. That's what we like to see. The right hand event's always more popular than our left hand, which is a bit of a shame because I like left hand driving. There's just not enough maps on the right hand side for us to keep us busy at the moment. Obviously, when Yorkshire 3 is released, uh, we'll have another CCS map, which would be really nice. The BAR coaches sound exactly like that what? because they have the same engine. I actually love the D8K engine sounds. Yeah, it, like I said, these are nice and smooth and quiet. They're great. They're great little bus, these. Richard Collins, hello. Uh, in the kitchen doing the cooking for weekly fish and chips. Yeah, you always have your fish and chips on a Friday, don't you? Uh, Richard Collins, you're fusing the stretch. Yeah, you just went past me on the map. I'll give you a honk. You were just going up to Tootnez when I was coming out. Oh, 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 oh. There we go. I had to think about it. Uh, yeah, nice to have you here for another week, mate. Much, much appreciated that you've come tagged along and you're getting involved in the company. It's great. We've got quite a few new drivers again this week. Uh, a couple of drivers in the driving school, which is always good. It's always good to see new drivers coming to our CCS and BCS as well. Um, Jamie can't do an Express 91 event. I would join as I had the DLC and it's free. Yeah, I mean, when we do left-hand drive, we generally do freeware stuff as well. Uh, obviously, there is a Steam sale on as well, guys, at the moment uh, for a lot of OMSI stuff. 
But um, yeah, yeah. We do do a lot of free stuff. As well. Uh, I know a lot of the guys really want to do the Hamburg Modern. Very, very soon. Um, yeah. I see you have a new bus on this route. Yep. I don't know how this would do going the other way on the 12. I don't know if it would get up the hill. The it's, it's very, uh, performance is very poor. As in, you know, it's quite realistic. The, these uh, Volvos don't get up the hills very well. Uh, Amy Lou's just about to pass us. She must be on the 35. Let's give her our old honk. Oh, Jonathan Holmes is coming up now on the X-35 as well. We'll give him a honk, everybody's here. Hamburg is great. Uh, yeah, Steam Cell on for now, OMSI stuff, and I'm 15p off Spectra. <laughs> yeah, Spectra's a good bus. <laughs> Not a bad bus. Might join the driving school once Yorkshire County 3 comes out and I bought BCS. Uh, well, Dylan, like I said, if you do want to go get BCS, I do have a discount code as well, uh, which means you pick it up. I think you get 30% off or something like that. Um, yep. Yeah. So you might be joining us soon, hopefully. Hopefully Yorkshire counties won't be too much longer now. We can all cross fingers and toes. Uh, what bus and Bailing Classics are you looking forward to? Uh... I don't know. I'm quite looking forward to, to most of them, to be honest with you. The only one that doesn't interest me so much is the articulated stuff, but um, I'd just be happy when it finally gets released. I mean, we haven't heard anything much on the veiling recently, so it'd be nice to have an update on what's going on. You know, I, I try not to get too excited or think about things until I know they're coming. On the 12, the MMC I just did when sluggish up the hill to the hospital. Yeah, this would be even worse than the MMC. The MMC has more power than this thing. A computer virus, hello mate, hello. Good evening, good evening. Uh, one day Arjun, one, not, one day you'll come and join us. Well, I know that Yorkshire Counties is not a big install. Um, if you think about London, London was over nine gigabytes. I think um, Yorkshire Counties is like three and a half or something. So it's uh, it's not a big install, which is good news. Uh, the L94 is the one I'm most looking forward to. Yeah, the B7 looks good, I must admit. I'm looking forward to the whole pack. But like I said, we haven't really heard we haven't actually heard much about the veiling in a while, so hopefully um, it's all going ahead and hopefully we'll get some news soon. It'll be really nice, wouldn't it? Hopefully, uh, hopefully we'll hear something. I really want in the veiling classic is the man Meridian, as they have them by me. an old bus that isn't it uh yeah you're in Luton right with the local route using the Dunstable busway oh, okay you're not asking me that's fine um so Daniela Long BCS is the bus company simulator yeah but what we're running tonight is CCS which is control center simulator you don't need to have the BCS for the CCS side of things, but you might as well get both. Yeah, I mean, like I said, um, we haven't really had an update on the veiling in a while, so yeah, it'd be nice. Oh, crap. I'm trying to read your chat. Uh, speaking of B8s, that's your new local bus of replacing solars. Nice. Uh, transport fan, uh, you would have seen me many times uh, back in the day when I worked for National Express. I used to always do that four, was it four, five, six to Cambridge, stopping in Newton. I was up there every bloody day.
Have I played Gladback? Yep, yep, yep. I think I've done a video on it once or twice. I tend to do videos on maps that we add to the... Uh, uh, for the green light? No, for National Express is who I used to go up there for. But yeah, I, I generally do videos on maps that we add to the company that month and stuff. Do you really need to, to learn how properly? to drive? Nah. Apparently I need to learn how to drive too. Ah, oh, the 757. Yeah, that sounds better. God, it's been a long time since I've, I've been up that way. Yeah. Got to Luton Airport, Luton City, up to Cambridge. Nice run. It's actually a nice run. Luton Airport can be a bit of a balls. Have you read Yorkshire 3 County status lately? Yes, I get pinged it quite a lot. <laughs> um, yeah, who knows what that means? Has anyone, has anyone cracked the code? He's trained for college, so I see Bedford sucks. Oh. <laughs> yeah. It's always the way, isn't it? Ah, Luton City, Luton Town. Same thing. <laughs> oh, the map is struggling tonight, isn't it? Mike, you don't know if you should say. I mean, you can say what you like in the chat. I mean, I don't. I, I, I you know. I, I, I'm, I can't confirm and I can't deny, I can't do anything. So, you know, if you guys have some ideas what you think. Um, Yorkshire County 3 might be on the 5th because of a tweet, get fireworks ready and a big file dump update on the Steam page for it. Uh, maybe. You know what Sile is like. He, he's quite he's quite smart with those kind of things. I've seen him, I've seen him uh, pull these kind of things before. So it could mean anything. It could mean anything. Possible. It is. It is very much possible. I'm not getting my hopes up though. Everyone seems to be saying this. <laughs> I, I mean, look, content access has gone out, so it can't be too far away. I think he's releasing on the 5th. Yeah, fair enough. I just wonder, is there more to that tweet than meets the eye? Because I think it's a bit too obviously in your face to be the 5th. But I don't know. Well, I didn't sit on the V3D website because I'm not I'm not a fool. <laughs> uh, why do you think the 5th of November? Are you talking to me? Oh, you must be talking to Mike. He said the clue was in the post. Oh yeah, I got DM'd it like a thousand times before I even looked at my own Twitter. Uh, also, people realised George County 3 was updated yesterday on... The uh, what people realised. I mean, it can still mean anything. Oh, Chabs is actually on here tonight. Chabs, I'll give you a honk, mate. I don't know if you're watching the stream, but I did, did send a thank you. Just about to do the part on the XV5. Nice. Yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe. Who the hell knows? The clue is in the post. But is that much of a clue? If you had sat there for two hours for a site update. Yeah, like I said, I... I... Pebble 4 again. Where's Pebble 4? Oh. Father Jack's with us again. It better be the 7th. <laughs> You had to sat there. Yeah, 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 I read that. 
It was on the What's he prattling about now? Uh, Richard, when you come back here, every time you have to mute yourself, mate. What? What? Okay, I'll mute him for himself. Everyone else will be able to hear him, though. Uh, if it's on the Steam database, anything is possible. Yeah, yeah, true. Yeah, mute yourself, yeah, mute yourself on, the, on the green button, if you say that. Uh, I only have 25 in the bank, so I might not be able to get it on release day. Uh, if you, if you, um, oh, you should have, I'll tell you what, if you click the little radio thing at the top, oh, no, that's it, you're off line, aren't you? You're, you're driving, aren't you? Uh, it should just be showing. It should just be showing. Okay, I'm going to mute both of them while they work that out. Uh, yeah, chaps, good. I'm glad you saw it. Much appreciated, mate. Uh, Silo already said that. Said what? I've missed, I've missed something here. Firework right, bonfire night might be November 5th. I right, see, I don't know about bonfire night. I've completely forgotten the date because I live here. We don't celebrate bonfire night. Is it the 5th? Uh, he said if you've not got fireworks this year, then you may need them. But isn't there that festival Diwali? Isn't that using festival? Isn't that, isn't that in like end of November? You got Thanksgiving, end of November. I don't know. I'm just just throwing it out there. I don't, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. It says you'll need fireworks. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, I, I have no idea on the price yet. Yeah, the one thing you had said, it will be lower than the base game, for sure. Yeah. I won't know anything until you guys know, you know. Hey, we have some people getting off here. Lots of happy customers. Yeah, it's a good shot. It's a good shot, the fifth. So if you click a computer, that's it. Hold on. I wonder if Sila's watching this laughing his ass off. Diwali is on the 4th of November. Oh, is it? Oh, okay. I thought Diwali was in, like, the, the end of November. <laughs> Thanksgiving? I don't know. Uh, K13, no worries, mate. My car's just gonna drive straight into me, nice. Uh, your birthday's on the 7th, so you know the bonfire's near. <laughs> How much is your chip? We are, there's no price being given yet. We don't know. We don't really know anything. We're just we're just guessing from Sila's tweet. I just wonder is he lurking and laughing? He said it won't be more than the, the base game, so it's not going to be more than twenty-seven, whatever the base game is these days. I don't even know. Okay, I thought Diwali was like the end of November. Interesting. Look, most DLCs for OMSI are roughly around that £25 mark. Roughly. So, yeah, that's a good it's a good kind of bet to go on, you know what I mean? Hello, chaps. Hello. Job done. Can I get another one, please? You can, mate. Uh, <laughs> Do you want something different? I'll <laughs> change it. Don't mind at all. Lucky dip. Roger, roger. Um, 45, let's go I'm going to give you the same one again. Uh, Parker Rider, right? Yep, sure. Sorry, yours, mate. Thanks very much. Cheers. I need to get a job as I've got three on five work experience hours from my college. Oh, yeah, nice. There's always plenty of work out there, isn't there?
Northeast Travelling, hello, good evening. <laughs> I bet he's laughing at all of us. <laughs> we should do like a... Um, we should put a pot in and do like a wager winner takes all if we all put down dates for the next like, you know, couple of weeks. <laughs> See who wins. Oh, the buzz. Good evening. How are you, my friend? Flying Sunday? Doing out here as well. He's lurking. Nice, nice to have a few lurkers. If Yorkshire 3 does come out on the 5th, then I'd need to wait two more days to get it. Uh, yeah, the XF35 is almost done. We're at Memorial Crescent now, yeah. Let's get another route. Uh, hello, good evening. Can I get another route? Is there anything from Memorial Crescent? Please. Uh, let's have a look. Got one at 11.50. Oh, no, I'll tell you that's already given. Um... No, they've got nothing from Memorial Crescent, mate. Ooh, okay. I'll spawn in somewhere else. What have you got? Oh, I've got a, I've got a 12. You can drive to the harbour. It's two hours at 12... Uh, at the hospital, sorry. Two hours at 12.15. At the hospital, yeah? Yeah. All right, I'll take it. All yours, mate. Cheers, buddy. All yours. Little driving there. Uh... <laughs> Yes, mate, where are we off to? Uh, I'm not sure yet. Um, I'll make up my mind on Sunday. Uh, we'll see what ATC we've got for us that are flying online. Uh, it'll be something short, something about an hour, 10, 15 minutes as usual. Okay, drive to our next tour. Uh, so we're doing the hospital. We are doing the 12, aren't we? Okay. Let's uh, cancel this. Let's uh, spawn at the hospital. If it is set for the 5th, then I would have to get my U37 video scheduled soon. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm not muted in the sim. Sorry. Sorry, everyone. Uh, yeah, so... Um... <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, crap. Now I've just clicked on spawn a bus. Hot mic, hot mic. <laughs> Everyone's going to be moaning at me now. God's sake. Listening to your crap. Okay. Just going to open this can of Coke very quickly. And like a cold can of coke. You can't beat coke in a can. It's the only place coke needs to be. Okay, Monday to Friday. Uh, 102. Uh, we're taking to 12.15. Uh, uh, I think we're going to Stanley, aren't we? That's still signed in. Yeah. The only thing is, my destination isn't working for some reason. I'm not sure why. I did use an MS one. I didn't like it though. Yeah, sounds good, mate. Perfect flight time for me. Yeah, I don't ever do more than about an hour and hour and 10, 15 minutes anyways, because in case the uh, ATC takes too long. But yeah, if you're in, you're in. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. Okay, so I mean, we might as well just speed up our time, really, aren't we? We're ready to go. Uh, so if we do 12, 13. There we go. the wrong bloody keys. Uh, what flight are we doing? I'm not sure. So what we do with the flights um, is I don't decide until about half an hour before the stream just because um, we always try and make sure 
if we're going to fly in bat sim that we have atc going out we don't worry about atc for landing if it's there it's there but we we kind of plan the route based on that so i'd like to do something from cardiff or bristol would be quite nice because uh, i haven't flown from those airports in a while but okay what's going on here bloody doors the handbrake wasn't going on all right all right mate that kid looked dodgy as hell, eh? <laughs> Did you see him? Okay, I just need to start my Omni navigation. Shell stops. There we go. I'm just here for the CCS event, relaxing. Nice to actually sat chilling. Hey, you should have come and done a drive with us. Done a drive or two. Good money. Good money, Anna. We'll have to get some uh, Yorkshire County's uh, three... CCS events planned whenever release date is. You'll have to come join us for one of them, maybe. Cardiff to Heathrow. That's a bit short. Probably like something like Cardiff to Amsterdam or something. Uh, Steve, are you getting messages in the office? Uh, hello. hello, mate. All done on my last run. You can uh, assign me anything you like, mate. Everything all right, Roger? It was all good. Sweet. Yeah, I'm a ticket inspector <laughs> on and off, and that was it. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, so basically, as long as there's some ATC, well, if there's some ATC in Scotland, we'll go from Scotland. Do we plan on the evening, really? Nice one, I'll get on to it, thank you. Yeah, I might do the A320 this week. It'll be the A320 or the BAE 146 again. I haven't decided. I am trying to learn the MD80 at the moment, uh, but it's not going so well. That's all I can say. It's not going very well. Uh, the Flight Fact Day 320 actually had an update for the Neo as well, so yeah, maybe, maybe that's what we'll do. I haven't flown in a while. So yeah, we'll be flying Sunday, and then the rest of the week uh, will be a bit of OMSI and we'll look a bit more at Yorkshire County uh, 3 probably, that's the plan. Cardiff Amsterdam is a perfect flight, nice little flight down. Yeah. Just hopefully we've got some London ATC, but that's the kind of flight I'd be uh, looking for, Buzz. Anyway, that's what I always look for. I never go any longer than that, anyways. The only good thing for you is once you're set up, you can get flying. We have to bloody wait around the airports. Amsterdam usually always has ATCs. Very busy airport. Very busy airport. Are you back on P3D now, Buzz? I need to get those repaints touched up again for you then if you're back on P3D. The ones that we had done, we just need to uh, get it working on a bloody aircraft of yours. What I need actually is um, pictures of that directory, is what I need. Come on, love. Good day, driver. Good day. <laughs> oh. God, that scares the living crap out of me. Mayday, mayday. Someone's dying. If you if you if if you're watching what I was watching, Richard driving, you'd, you'd agree with that as well. Okay, mate. Yeah, is Richard um, driving now? Is he? Yeah, well, if that's what you can call it, I. <laughs> uh, your next stop is Tutless Road, isn't it? After this one. Uh, yeah, probably. Uh, okay, mate. Ambulance on the way. There in five minutes. Cheers, mate. No worries, mate. God, I'm... that noise. Okay, well, we're in no rush. Uh, I will wait 
on the guys to take off nice track of assault. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we had a nice little pattern the other day when we all flew out. It was, it was really cool. Everyone that was online and offline. It was only me and Harvey that got left behind because... Uh, but the ATC was quite polite. He apologised. Oh, I didn't realise you were doing a group flight. I told him it didn't matter, but it was very nice that he messaged me to say sorry. I tried to pick airports that aren't too busy, you see, as well, so we can get in and out pretty quick. But we're all flying A340s, that was the problem. Yeah, I'm back on the stream, Bradley Mel, good evening. Cruise R2 270. Oh. Yeah, I, I, to be honest with you, it depends on the ATC, what they give you. But yeah, something like that, usually. Wouldn't need to go very high for that. Okay, was that Andy North just gone past us? I don't know who that is. Is he in our CCS tonight? B.G is on the way as well. well. We'll move over lanes here. Uh, I will be on P3D Sunday, but I have a view of doing a lot more stuff on Microsoft. Okay, perfect. Obviously, I assume when PDMG bring out their 737, you're going to be full-time Microsoft Flight Simulator buzz. And it does make it a bit easier for the painter because it's a program that a lot more use. <laughs> uh, Steg, good evening. Hello. There's an ambulance. No, no, no. Very naughty to cut over lanes, but we're going to... Fusion Distress is here, and B.G. Is everyone broken down in, in the same spot? What's going on, guys? Bum, 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 bum. Okay, we're going to have a few minutes wait here while we wait for someone to come save our lady. I do like the new humans. It's nice to have a different set of people. It makes the game look new. He's a scary bugger, isn't he? Okay, we've got nothing to do while we wait for help. We have three minutes. Uh, you're doing a favor, but okay. Everyone's just stopped at the same spot. <laughs> yep, we're waiting for the ambo. Nino, Nino. Uh, yeah, absolutely, mate. Can't wait for that plane to come out. Yeah, it won't be long now. I don't think. I think it'll be out before Christmas. I think that's their intention anyways. Yeah, Microsoft, that's one thing Microsoft is really lacking. The game is great, but it really does lack a Boeing. Like that 747 is a load of crap. And the 787 isn't much better to be honest with you. Uh, Fly J Sims Twin Otto will be out next week, I think as well. That, that I'm very excited for. I don't know. I, I, I did choose the MS ones, but I don't know. BCS being BCS, maybe I'd ball something up. It is a shame that I've not got it working tonight. It's okay. Uh, the repaint's a bodge job anyways, in the fact of like the seats aren't done either. Uh, as you know, he's made catch you later. It's not a problem. Yeah, yeah. The Air, well, the Airbus is only good because of uh, fly, uh, the fly-by-wire team. It, it, if they hadn't done what they done to that Airbus, it, they would all be pretty poor. The best planes are the GA planes. Uh, no, we're waiting for an Ambo. We have a lady with a heart attack. Old oh, Doris. But yeah, even with the Sparky mod on that 747, it's just even with all the updates it's had, it's just terrible. The 787 ain't too bad. I reckon be the best part of 100, yeah. Look, PDMG, you know, they're always top dollar, but you know what you're paying for. You know it's going to be quality, Buzz. It's no, you're not even going to question, you know, it's going to be quality. For sure. Yep, 
Yeah, I'm good, mate. How are you? How are you? Hey. Okay, we rescued Doris in the nick of time. Yeah, this is the Simply Connect repaint on the bus at the moment, yeah. Where are we going? Uh, we're going to the harbour. We're on Route 12. Good, mate. Good. This bus is on the highway to hell. I see that they're, they're, they're coming back on tour here soon, actually, ACDC, isn't it, I think? I think I saw something, there was tickets going for them. Wouldn't mind going to see them. Uh, what event was happening? Uh, we had Doris, she was having a, a heart attack on the bus. Poor Doris. Uh, but she's okay, she's okay. She was rescued in, you know, nick of time. Oh, because most of you are here during my meltdown last week. Uh, for any of my channel members, you do have uh, a new emoji. There are some new emojis coming this week as well, but here we go. I'll put it up for you. I'm sure some of you guys will love the new emoji for the channel members. That's if it posts. <laughs> I don't know, did I post it or not? So I see DC in Camden about 10 years ago. Wow. I wouldn't mind to see them, to be fair. I think it'd be a great, great night out. I don't know, is my chat frozen? I don't know, did I break my chat with my emoji? Do you not want me? Oh. I am surprised. Uh, I'm just trying to get rid of my chat thing so I can actually see what's going on. Oh, God. How annoying is that? I want my box to be bigger. Uh, what number is this bus? We're on the 12, mate. Oh yeah, the hill climb's gonna be brutal. <coughs> uh, cones, yeah. So any of my channel members, you now have the new cones. Uh, <laughs> I thought you'd all like them. It's just in case we ever needed to measure cones going forward. Yeah, that's, that's it, the two close together. So yeah, if we ever need to compare cones... Oh, someone just passed us. I, I didn't see who it is. I've missed the name on the map now. Uh, Father Jack, oh! Father Jack! That's why he's not in the chat tonight. He's actually driving. Um, Father Jack, who's a long-term servant of the channel. 
Uh, he, he brought a wheel and his deal was if he ever got a wheel he'd get OMSI. Uh, and he hates OMSI. <laughs> and he got BCS, CCS and he's now driving for us. Uh, he will be in the office very soon. Well, I'm having my old memory leak here, aren't I? Uh, Ross, it's good to be busy. Better be busy than have nothing to do. You'll end up like me. Yeah, Kevin, that, that, that might be alright. Make sure there's a good kind of five spaces between, right? <laughs> yeah, so I am updating the uh, the members thing for their perks and stuff. So there will be there will be new uh, emojis this week. Uh, no one's pressed the button. What am I doing? Oh yeah, nice. Yeah, I must admit, I'm quite lazy. When I unplug my wheel, I literally put it on the floor next to my chair here because the wheel comes up and down so bloody often. I, I mean, I've got a spot for it behind me here, behind the screen, but because I'm forever on and off, on and off, I just friggin... Even the, the flight controller sticks are down there. <laughs> okay, we're going to need some speed for the next bridge. Hello. My logo is actually on those cones. Unfortunately, it's not big enough, isn't it? There's any problem with emojis. But yeah, my... I don't know how you get the big ones. Okay, let's get out of here while we can. Okay, full speed ahead. Uh, you're doing the 222. Nice. Uh, so anyone that does play BCS, CCS, uh, isn't the uh, short route here going to be finished this weekend, isn't it? Okay, full speed. Uh, Arjun, he's published a couple of books. You can find them on Amazon. He can put a link there, Ross, if you fancy it. More than welcome to put a link to your books on the Amazon store. You can get them on the Kindle or you can buy a paperback, I think. I've got a unit for my kid to put my desktop on and the wheel under. Yeah, I'm just so lazy, like, behind me here, basically I have an IKEA unit behind me, it's like one of those box things. So the wheel can go in there, but I'm just... Because I'm forever pulling it in and out, I just now dump it on the floor. <laughs> it's terrible, I know. Absolutely terrible. I need to do what the bigger YouTubers do, you know, they have one PC for flight sim, one PC for, for bus driving, all set up on different... in a room, that's what I need. Mag is just going past me. Explore Dundee as well. I don't know if they're driving with us tonight, are they? Uh, is that the name of those white things? Yeah, Cali it does ring a bell. Uh, be right back. Noise, mate. Whee! Nearly went into the back of the old Ford Focus. Okay, let's get another Doris on. I just don't have a lot of desk room. My desk is very small between the screens, microphone, lights, wheel. Like, there's just no room uh, for me to ha have anything nice.
Hey, driver. Hello. Yeah, those are the kind of thing I was on about. If I had the room, you know, you could set up different stations, but yeah. I, I don't have no room. I'm in like a little square here, and, and that's about it. <laughs> Uh, Leo, hello, good evening. Uh, so, so far we've done the X35, we're on the 12. And imagine we'll probably do the 12 back, we'll see what routes are available. We're on CCS, so it is whatever we get given. Uh, Mike, no worries, welcome back, mate. How's your BCS company going, Mike, by the way? I have three monitors on my desk, stereo PC desk. I use a saw table to drag that over for my wheel. <clears throat> yeah, like between my monitors, and I want to get a third monitor, but it's going to have to be mounted on the wall up there. Yeah, we'll see. I don't know if this. I don't know if OMSI can work on the controller. Not entirely sure. Okay, I don't know if we're gonna have enough speed for this hill. Foot down. SGUK, hey, how do you know how I stopped lagging on G2 in the high end PC? Uh, put it this way, I run a very high NPC. There's no way to stop it. Uh, OMSI is an old 32-bit game. It runs on one core speed. Uh, so it doesn't matter what system you've got. It just does not, you know, it, lag is always going to be there, unfortunately. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Oh, this is brutal. Did it? I think if I ever asked my parents to buy me a book, I think they'd have a heart attack. <laughs> uh, you're doing a route 232 on Gladback, nice. Yeah, I wouldn't mind adding Gladback back to the... Um, that lorry just drove through that car. I wouldn't mind adding uh, back to the company maybe next month. Yeah, probably. I've, I've never tried it with a controller. I don't know anyone that has. Not bad, just concentrating on refurbishing the allocated buses in different places at the moment. My friend did analysis for games and stuff. Oh, nice, that's cool. Holly Aviation, good evening. How are you? We'll be back flying on Sunday. Yeah, Ross is in the uh, Discord there. Uh, you missed a few streams. Yeah, we had a good flight the other night. We flew into um, into Paris. Oh, <laughs> that was my fault. I got a bit heavy on the old brake. Uh, yeah, we flew into Paris the other night on Vatsim. And it was uh, absolutely brutal. I couldn't get the plane to do what I wanted it to do. And then uh, I couldn't understand the French guy either. It was an absolute nightmare. Ben B, when are you going to come do a Vatsim flight with us? I know you were doing bits and pieces of it. The Vatsim flight's open to everybody and anybody. Don't have to be a part of the virtual airlines. Yeah, my depot is too many buses. I think we have 108 buses currently. 
such a long stand time had time to get drinks ice cream and still have 10 minutes left <laughs> No, I don't think Ollie's been here for a while. I can't remember, to be honest. Ah, uh, okay. Been flying a Sukhoi Superjet, smaller than the A318. Yeah, that's not too bad. Never heard of it. I flew the A340 600. Oh, we should have right away here. 600 the other night had a pretty bad landing. There we go. Hey, look, the open deck is here. Simply connect. I forgot we had that bus. I need to do some more videos in that. I haven't driven that rooftop bus in ages. I think the 12 goes on this side, right? Okay, guys, even with the delay, another route done. <coughs> uh, hello, whoever's in the office. Could I get another route, please? Yes. Uh, what, what, which one do you want? Anything in particular? Uh, what, what, whatever's next. So you can do a park and ride if there's one. I haven't done one of them in a while. Right, so uh, there is at 12.40. It's all yours. Cheers, mate. Okay, 12.40 does not give us a lot of time to get up there, but hey-ho. We won't complain. Need better driving scores, though. We're not doing very well tonight. Come well, on, got my next tour. Okay, we are going to do... Park and Ride. Uh, the Coventry Spotter, how did you get beta of this? What, the bus? Because uh, I have access to Yorkshire Counties 3, my friend, uh, as I was doing uh, content for that. Do, 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 do. What else have we got in here? I, I bus, I'm also on this map doing a shift in the severe snow. <laughs> awesome. That hill will be alright, cow. Uh, it is snowing, heading back on the XV5. Oh, nice. Yeah, okay, so we better get going here because we're going to be late. Uh, Monday to Friday, what are we doing? 112, 112, 112, here we go. Uh, 13, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh yeah, 1240. <laughs> there we go, it's there. Mm -hmm. Come in, people. Come in. Hello there. How dare they complain about my low temperature in my bus? Hi. Hello, driver. Hello, dear. All good. All good. Let's get out of it. Doris already wants to get off. Uh, how on earth you're lucky? Uh, what, for Yorkshire County 3? Uh, yeah. Yeah, look, I was asked, and uh, yeah. I've already covered Yorkshire County 3 quite a bit. We'll be covering a lot more of it uh, this week as well, so there'll be a lot more streams on Yorkshire County 3. There are videos tomorrow and Sunday. Um, oh, for frig's sake, our bus has just blown up. Uh, can I get some mechanics to somewhere? I've lost my electrics, but I've just moved away from the bus stop. Uh, yeah. Uh, oh, what the hell? Yes. Right, uh, is, it, is that sharing now? 
Yeah, whatever. Uh, hang on, I don't even know what my next stop is. You're but to roll according to this. Uh, Patent Royal Hospital. Patent Royal Hospital. Oh, right out on way. They're in five minutes. Cheers, mate. Okay, so we have no electrics on our bus, so we have to get to the next stop. Uh, we're now on the 100. Uh, Daniel, you have 140 buses. Yeah, we got a good amount of buses here in our depot too. Uh, train sim there. There will be a lot of train stuff coming very soon. I know a lot of stuff came out on train sim. Dovetail have sent me some things. Um, oh my god! I've just put my priorities into OMSI at the moment and flying. Uh, but yeah, we'll get back to it. Uh, yeah, that was the electrics blowing up in the bus. <laughs> So, as you can see, I've got no lights on the dash now. There's no lights on the bus. Um, once we get to the next stop, someone will come fix it. Chabs is going by. I can't even give him a honk because everything's broken. Got no indicators. I've got nothing. <laughs> Best Essex is just passing us by now as well. Beep, beep, toot, toot. This was a brand new bus. Yeah, it's even worse when the lady has the heart attack. It scares the crap out of me. Like she did in the last run. <laughs> Thank you, Arjun. <clears throat> Happy Friday and Buckfast and beer up in Glasgow. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah. Wouldn't mind a beer myself. Got a can of Coke here. myself when the lady had the heart attack <laughs> yeah yeah it does even when the guy does the drunken thing he sounds like he's shooting everybody and the glass is breaking yeah he's in uh, Greta doing a rally in Glasgow tomorrow for I'd say world peace uh, for the green world or you know Uh, more of a Rangers than a Celtic fan. Uh, Jonathan Holmes is now passing us. I can't give him a two. Arjun will have to do it. I don't even have an indicator. Terrible driving. Glasgow will be underwater by twenty fifty. I think a lot of the world could be underwater by by twenty fifty. Um, Kevin, I actually haven't had a chance. I've been so busy. Um, this last two weeks, I've had a lot of stuff sent to me, and I've been trying to cover it all. Literally just had no time. Cop 26, then. That's, yeah, that's what they're calling it. The 
There's no electrics. Uh, yeah, I, I know, I know. Well, speed needles can still work if they're run. Um, depends how they run, to be honest. Two weeks. Is that how long it's going on for? Bloody hell. Six. Hello, mate. I'm Hello. all done. Um, have you got an X35 I could do, please? Uh, an X35? Yeah, have you got one? Let's have a look for you, mate. Thank you. Uh, I have indeed. It's for yours. His first Essex Lovely. in our Thank company. Thank you very much, mate. Take care. Cheers, mate. I can't even open the doors. Uh, what do I think about it? Look, it's great that the world leaders want to do something, but as long as they do something about it. Going to all these big meetings, flying their big planes. Didn't, didn't the President of the United States bring over like half a dozen armored cars and all this kind of stuff? You know, we're talking about ha having a greener world. <laughs> Just waiting for the bus to be repaired by the repairman. There we go. We're all good. G's here now and explore Dundee again. We'll give him the two. Now I've got my horn back. Oh, nice, mate. Fly Biden in with all his stuff equates to 200,000 an hour. Yeah, it's ridiculous. Yeah, I know, that's what I'm talking about. We're talking about, you know, climate change, but he sent over like there was Harrier jets flown in to escort Air Force One, and uh, come on. <laughs> it's, it's the kind of crap that's it's half the problem, isn't it? London is already going green with electric buses for in the routes. Yeah, we're, we're quite good here. We've got quite a few electric hydro buses coming. Um, our problem here with emissions in Ireland is our cows. Cows create more emissions than a motorbike doing, you know, 100 miles. Uh, one cow, you know, it's it's crazy. And obviously, our meat, our meat and uh, cow market is pretty important to us. So I don't know how they're going to cut emissions down. Uh, we need to go clean, but I don't think the world will do it right. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's so hard to tell, isn't it? Did you stream the, the run, Father Jack? Is that what you did? Uncomplied vehicles pay twelve fifty. Yeah, yeah. Same the buses. All the buses had to be uh, same. Us, oh, Silas back. I mean, <clears throat> the imposter's back. Yeah. So this is going green. Like I said, it just. How can you go? All the world leaders are gonna fly into that one spot. Biden was bringing all his um, armored cars and all this other stuff with him. There was there were planes arriving a couple of days ago into Glasgow. Yeah, right hand will go electric. It won't be long. Like I said, we we've already got quite a few. If they don't go fully electric, they'll definitely go with the hybrids like the MMCs. They have like a a 2.6 diesel engine to charge the battery and stuff like that. But it's a lot smaller than you know a 10 liter. B10 or whatever. Hi Jack, good evening. 
Like he, he screen shared. <laughs> uh, Air Canada, do you plan taking part on Cross the Pond? Unfortunately, I didn't get a slot. I know you could just do it if you wanted to tomorrow. Um, but no, unfortunately, I won't be doing Cross the Pond tomorrow. But I have promised everybody the next Cross the Pond, I will stream the whole thing. C17 landed the other day with Gary S there. See, that's what I mean. That, that's the crap. <clears throat> it's very hard to climb the change. We've done so much damage. To try and reverse that damage is always going to be very difficult at this point. Uh, Sunday night is our next fast in flight, Glenn. And if even if you're a bit nervous, don't don't be. If you uh, because there'll be three or four of us, you just listen to what we say or what they tell us. Tell us back. It gives you a lot more chance to write it down because we're all going to have the same flight plan. <clears throat> it's just, it's just so nice to be sat chilling for once. I'll admit that. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I bet. You'll be sunning up in the Bahamas before you know it. Uh, but yeah, Sunday night, Glenn. Sunday night. <laughs> I made homemade pizza for dinner today. It was all right. Quite hungry now to be fair. Alright, Glenn, no worries. Like I said, uh, the good thing is because there's always now three or four of us that do it, uh, it gives you more chance to uh, to listen in and just hear what they're saying. So, like, sometimes they talk a bit fast, uh, you know. It isn't too bad. I've actually got a sheet, Glenn, I'll send it to you, that I made up for myself when I first started. And basically where the gaps are is where the information needs to be filled. And it just gives you a rough guide on what you need to say when. You don't have to follow it to a T. But um, it just gives you a, a good basic. Uh, no holidays for you, no. <laughs> I'd love a holiday. Waiting on chicken, Yorkshire pudding, roast. Oh, mm, nice. I had a roast in a little while. I roast lamb about two weeks ago. That was quite nice. Uh, we are on the park and ride 100 currently. Following the street light around. So yeah, so we are flying Sunday. But yeah, I'll send you that sheet once the stream's done. Even Steve took the plunge. Even Richard came and did one. You should watch Richard's uh, stream where he came on to Vatsim. That was a good one. No, right, Richard. You loved it. <laughs> He's a flight as a little rusty. Yeah. But the A340 flies all right. It's a bit of a funny one to land. I usually put the chicken fat in the gravy. Ryan Whittle, hello mate, good evening. 
Oh, sorry, Doris. Come in. Hello. Hello. Good if we had a handbrake off. Okay, next stop, promenade. Richard, Glenn B's thinking about taking the plunge onto Vatsim by saying that uh, you enjoyed yourself on your first time, didn't you? Okay, how long of a wait do we have here? Uh, 12.54. We don't. Oh yeah, we're late, look. <laughs> okay. Chicken fat in the gravy where you're okay. No, yeah, that's how I make the gravy. You put all the fat in the gravy. That's the best place. Just notice know X-Plane 11 is on sale. Worth getting or should I hold off to X-Plane? Ah, uh, mate, it's a real tough one. It's a real tough one. I don't know when X-Plane 12 is going to come out. But yes, X-Plane is currently at £31, I believe, on Steam. It's a good price. But yeah, I, I, I don't know, mate. It's a tough one. If, if we knew what date it was coming, it'd be easier. You know, X-Plane 12 might not come till this time next year. You, you just don't know. They, they've released, they're releasing images and stuff, but... Oh, God, I hate when it does that. When you're going on corners. Come on. Need to calibrate my quadrant for the A340 as I started up yesterday. The engines were running high. Really? When I plugged it in, my, my A340 worked straight out of the bat. I didn't have to do anything. It's quite strange, that. Huh? I must say I'm loving the LED blinds for the London C400, C200. Uh, the NRM will be done. I know that the um, Charlie Williams, I know that B dot has done. Um, uh, what's the other bus? The other crap one that comes with it. The Evo City. I know he's done that one already. That's the next one to be released. Uh, but yeah, I believe he will do the NRM. I can't see why he wouldn't. B-Dot might be in the chat there, he might tell you himself. Great game, but the problem is I have to play the keyboard. <laughs> yeah, steering wheel makes it. Hello. I put a lot of butter and stuff on my potatoes, a lot of garlic, potato, thyme. Doesn't need any more fat. That's why it goes in the gravy. <laughs> uh, I do like a good roast dinner. The last roast dinner I did was uh, roast lamb about a week ago. It was nice. I'm not a big f lamb lover, but I got outvoted. Whoa, I thought that woman was so going to run in front of me. Yeah, Beatles done a good job getting them out. Yeah. Uh, it's not the best though either like it's you know the lights the lights not working on the outside does a lot of people's head it's, it's, it's all right it's it's all right it's not brilliant either <laughs> but anyways evo city has been done um i know he's done that so i'm, I'm assuming that'll be the next one that he releases and uh yeah Did you see that the protesters there on the M25 super glued themselves to the ground using um, really bad glue for the environment? Did you see that? <laughs> it's not a popular map, but I like Bristol Airport every now and again. The NRM would be amazing to have an airport map. Yeah, like I said, I'm sure B Dot is in the chat there. He might be driving. I'm sure he was doing all the London buses. Will we get a traffic cone on top of a traffic light in Yorkshire? Um, no, but there is a new... Um, <laughs> I've got a new uh, emoji for my channel members. There are traffic cones now for, for channel members. I don't know if any of the channel members are even there. I don't know if anybody's there. Hello. <laughs> uh, East Coast Gamer, hello. 
Thanks to Tor, Dundee Explore. Ah, uh, that was you. Ah, oh, nice. Uh, Command Anderson. Oh, sugar. It's so hard to drive and talk sometimes. Um, nice. Nice that you come and done a couple of runs with us, for sure. We soon had the regional B5LH Evo Cities as they go northwest of a Jew. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Uh, when am I going back to work? I, you know, it's, it's a million dollar question at the moment. Um, I still have no news. Uh, well, I do have news. I saw a doctor a week ago. They've signed me off now until January next year at the moment. So I'm hoping for early next year. Early next year. Hello. Well. Hello. Oh, can you send me an ambulance? Can indeed. I can. Uh, where are you? Uh, your next stop is uh, North Chart Way. Is that right? North Chart Way. Okay. Uh, ambulance is there in 3 minutes 53. Uh, okay, so I need to drive to the next stop. Yes, not that way. Next stop, please. Okay, thank you. Cheers, man. Uh, LR Gaming, are you in our BCS uh, company? You are more than welcome to come join us if you want, mate. Yeah, Glasgow's going to be mental. But yeah, the protest is super gluing themselves to the ground using a really bad glue that's for the environment. I thought it was brilliant. Oh, here's B dot. There we go. We've got some cones. Spacing them out. It wouldn't let me do it. I like how the M25 Pro say the Interstate Brim, but they haven't even bothered doing that themselves, of course. <laughs> yeah, I know. Uh, Richard Collins, become a channel member, 99p a month, and you can have a cone. <laughs> yeah. There's some other emojis there as well. They are getting changed this week. I had some new ones made. I was thinking about getting a repaint made for Simply Connect with the buses just looking like traffic cone. Uh, like loads of traffic cones all over it just for like a special one-off. Maybe I might try and get that done for this for the B8 for the release day, whatever that is. Hopefully I have enough time to make something. Yeah, there should be a button there on the, on the uh, stream. It says join. And that shows you what you can do. You also get uh, entry into the giveaways on the Discord. If your Discord and YouTube are linked, um, there's a special members area in the Discord. Uh, and I do special giveaways for the members. So basically, you get two giveaways every time I do giveaways. Ah, Suburban Media. Welcome to Do Your Bio. Much appreciated. Thanks very much. That music is bloody loud, though. Uh. Last time I played BCS, I flipped into a ribbon. <laughs> uh, driving school matters uh, to an extent. Look, we're, we're not we're not a strict strict company. We try and keep our ratings as high as possible. Uh, but look, uh, you're always more than welcome to come join the BCS company as well. Um, we have left hand, right hand. We swap out the left hand maps every month. Uh, so yeah, it's it's completely up to you. Completely up to you. You should do a first Glasgow bus, buddy. For the uh, for our repaints, we can look at doing something. Oh crap! Yeah, maybe I'll get a traffic cone bus. I think that'd be pretty funny. I see what I can do pretty fast. <laughs> I think I'm going back into the hospital here. Yeah, I mean, I know why they're, what they're doing on the uh, motorway. I understand why they're doing it, but it's a friggin' nuisance for people that do have to get to work. Do you think my boss gives a crap that I didn't get there on time because there were some people on the floor complaining, you know what I mean? When I used to drive around the M25 every day for National Express, imagine if I was dying to go to the toilet and, uh, you know, I'm stuck there on the M25. <laughs> Richard can't help himself, can he? Yeah. Like I said, super gluing yourself to the ground. Didn't the main guy super glue his face to the ground? Like, how stupid can you be? Like, you're making something that is a good cause just look 
dumb and it just annoys people more than anything that's the worst thing about it you're not going to get you're not getting public on side people are just getting pissed off you know but marcus doncaster good evening hello how are you I have to think of a good slogan for the bus. <coughs> Cone distance matters. Uh, Jack, are you in the office now? Is it, is it, are you on your own? <laughs> go going or go home. <laughs> Yeah, didn't a woman run one over as well or something? Ugh, not close enough for these damn people. To be fair, they're trying to get the point across, but yeah. They, I find that this stuff kind of happens. People always have good, valid points, but they do everything the wrong bloody way around. Like I said, super gluing yourself to the, to the ground is not helping anybody. You know, I'm pretty sure cars have less emissions if they're not on just standstill with the engines on sitting there in the cold you know engines running for hours because people are you know doing what they're doing but yeah this morning when i saw them super gluing their faces to the ground i just that's when you know you've gone too far you know what i mean uh, benny woods just gone past us let's give him a honk Good old benny What was the first company you worked for in real life and what doing what routes? Uh, first company I worked for was first. Uh, I was doing the 702 Greenwood Br Bracknell to London, Victoria. Not Victoria. Uh, a bloody coach station thing. Uh, but the 702 for first was my first job. Yeah. And I mainly did only Green Line. I did some of the other stuff, uh, some of the other Slough routes and stuff like Windsor and all that sometimes, but mainly 702. That was my board. Didn't a woman run one over and she said she'd do it again because the kid was late for school or something. But she was getting like ridiculous praise like she drove into someone apparently she was going to get sued or something I don't know. <laughs> but yeah those protesters man Jesus. I mean, they'll keep doing it and doing it and doing it, but that's not changing much, is it? Like I said, all you're doing is making people mad. The governments and stuff like that, well, I mean, it is people's attitudes to the environment. You know, that is a bit of it, but... You know, it's up to the government to start enforcing different rules or different things. <clears throat> what route's next? I don't know. It'll be the last one, whatever we do. I have no idea what we're going to do next. We'll see what we can get. Uh, B.G's just gone absolutely flying past me. I think he's driving one of um, Iron Beast's engines in his bus. What's it like driving the good old shite light? I'm not. <laughs> I'm driving uh, the Veiling, the B8 RLE, the one that uh, hasn't been released yet. The one that's coming with uh, Yorkshire County 3. The sheet, the, the, the shine lights, but the street lights I actually quite like in the game. 
Yeah, Glasgow's going to be absolutely caked in it next week as well. How to drive diesel cars? Yeah, it's a good question. How many How many of you guys actually have electric cars or ride a bike to work every day? Yeah, that'd be, that'd be a good one, wouldn't it? It'd be a good debate, you know. But that's how it is with people, isn't it? It's just the way it is. Yeah. See, what they did here, here is, like, old cars can't drive on our roads anymore because anything older than 15 years old, you can't insure in this country unless it's a classic. So, <clears throat> like, you know, cars have to be quite new in this country, otherwise you can't keep them on the road. Is it? No. Yeah, I'm not sure why my destinations didn't work. I did use the MS displays. I don't know what happened. Oh yeah, McDonald's, that'd be good. Get one of those uh, double-decker Big Mac things. Uh, oh, yeah, I didn't really drive many of the streetlights. I actually don't mind streetlights in real life. Um, I was driving the the Gen 3 Volvo things they have, or had. I know that I know that uh, Reading buses took over the 702 now, but... Um, yeah, I don't mind streetlights. That's why I actually quite like streetlights. They're not a bad bus, actually, to drive. They're quite comfy. They're slow, but they're always quite comfortable. And that was, that's the main thing. That is definitely the main thing. I do mainly coach work now. Yeah, Big Mac. Yeah, I, I, like there's a, it's like a double Big Mac now, is it, at the moment? That they have a special on? Yeah, we wouldn't mind a double Big Mac right now. And a box of 20 nuggets. <laughs> the toys are rubbish now, though. To be fair, I think I think they're Mr. Man books at the moment. Not, it's not that bad. I mean, if I was a kid and got a Mr. Man book in my McDonald's, I would have been quite happy back then. Yeah, and you know the thing that annoys me is that because the electric cars are quite expensive, and like every kind of five to seven years, the batteries need to be replaced. Because I had a look at getting an electric car, and it was going to cost me four grand every seven years to replace the batteries. So I don't think the technology is quite there yet. I mean, that was maybe a year ago. You know, there are some other ones now, but this is half the problem. And like the government, the government here have given us a 5,000 uh, euro tax levy, but what they've done, they've just jacked up the price of the car. So basically they're still claiming that money. It just looks like a good deal, but it's not a good deal. They were cheaper last year than they were this year. And it's mainly because of the, the government tax levy. So all the manufacturers just up the prices so they don't lose out. Yeah, I don't share 20 nuggets either. I smash 20 nuggets. You gotta get the curry sauce dip, some barbecue dip. I smashed a lot to myself as well, to be fair. The worst thing is about it, some of us need cars to commute for work and stuff, but there are so many people that could get public transport that just don't. They'd rather just go in their own car and do their own thing. Okay, we need to get more routes. Hello, who's in the office? Hello? Hello? Hello, sir! <laughs> what can you do for you, sir? Can I get a new route, please? It'll cost you 20 quid, mate. Yeah, that's fine. All right. Uh, oh, where no, do you want no. to go? Um, what's Paris? next? <laughs> what's next <laughs> on the list? Oh, just hold, take hold on, man. Look, you're in, you're, in, you're in the crap here, Jack. Look, you've got uh, Benny Hill now needs an emergency too, look. Hey, I'm, I'm doing the boss first. Just chill out. <laughs> well, what an abrupt man you are. Right, what do you want, sir? Uh, just You're a talk and ride? No, I've just done one of them. What's, ne what, what's next on the list? Uh, a Royal Hospital to Harbour, 24 minutes. I've done that. What's next on the list? Oh, for God. God, you're so picky. Hey, Crescent to Harbour, 80 minutes. How many minutes? Uh, yeah, okay, I'll take that. Right, done, signed. Right, who's next? Cheers, mate. All of them. Bye. Bye, sir. Three bags full, sir. 
Uh, hello. Uh, I'm uh, I'm Finnish. Finnish. <laughs> I go off. No. Okay, mate. Thank you. He's not muted himself again. Thank you, mate. I appreciate the help. Yeah. Okay. Cheers, mate. Bye. Cheers. Uh, prices are up because of the supply issues, though, so I've ordered a car on the 1st of October and they're not even giving me a build day yet. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, that's the other bad thing, is it, when you want to get a new car like that. It's like, it's, it's all good. Like, I be, I was looking at the new um, Mini uh, Electric, but you're right. We will buy the car and it'll take two years to be bloody delivered. Okay, so, set the schedule. What are we doing here? Monday to Friday. Jesus, we're due out now. Awesome. 114S. This is going to be the last one of the year for us with this, I think, isn't it? I'd imagine that we're the one two two. Bit of old flickering. Good old environmental pack. Okay, I just need to make sure I set all stops. There we go. There we go, last route of the night. My short one. Morning, sweetie. Morning, sweetie. China? What car did you buy? DRB, evening, is there some new passengers you've got? Yes, uh, we're very lucky after the last stream um, Chabs donated a couple of the human packs uh, to the channel So yeah, we got some new humans It's actually quite nice to have some new people walking around Omzu oh, An MGHS, nice Yeah, I think I've seen some in Belfast I'm pretty sure there's some HGV MGs that I've never seen before. I bet it's one of them. Uh, Mike, it's because the environmental uh, pack, sometimes it causes this little flicker. It'll go away in a minute. Uh, yeah, it's a little bit annoying when it does this, yeah. Hello, lad. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, I don't know why it does that. It is, it's bloody annoying. It will go away in a second though. No, Doris is still here. We still have a Doris. She's already had a heart attack. Cough. You can tell that I haven't reloaded in a while. The memory leak is uh, getting pretty terrible. There you go, it's gone again now. Yeah, so the environmental pack uh, causes that flicker occasionally. For whatever unknown reason. Uh, ADE777 is about to pass us. 
don't know if he's doing runs for us or not. No idea. Very nice. <laughs> yeah, we got Doris. Uh, yeah, I couldn't let Doris go. Keep telling myself every time I drive past this house that I need to watch that bottom movie, Guest House Paradiso again. I haven't watched it since, like, I'm about 12 years old probably, but... I do love a bit of bottom. Oh, look, Flickering's back. It might be because I've not refreshed it in a while, like, I haven't reloaded a new bus or anything. Oh, look, we got our first ticket inspector of the day. He's coming for a ride. Uh, yeah, I'm very much looking forward to the new buses. Yeah, for sure. Uh, yeah, so the new passengers are basically their human packs. Uh, so what you have to do, you just got to go into each individual map and add the, the line of code for them. It's very simple. Like, that's why I'd never done it before, because I thought it was a ball lake. Uh, and I was actually saying this on, on, on one of the last streams, and Chabs sent me a couple of the packs. He said, here you go. And, uh, yeah, they're very easy to install. You just read the manual. It tells you what you need to do very quickly. It takes about two minutes. And uh, yeah, it's nice to actually have some new passengers, I must admit. It nearly feels like a different game. Ugh. Go, go, go! And I believe they're all on sale currently as well. Steam does have a uh, OMG sale at the moment, was everything. It's got the Halloween sale for the weekend, so um, good chance to pick up something. I did apply for a key for Atlas, but I never heard anything back. I'll have a good look at it. I'll watch some videos and see. Have you streamed any of it? Yeah, DRB, definitely. Like, like I said, I was kind of against them. I said in the last stream, I thought they were hard to install. Uh, people told me different things. I was like, oh, I can't be bothered. Um, but like I said, Chabs sent a few uh, and I installed them. And yeah, it's all, uh, all nice and easy. And yeah, it's really nice that you have some new faces. And I think they're on sale, so they're probably only about three or four quid a pack. But what you have to do is go into the humans file of each in your map folder, and you just have to put in the line of code that comes with the uh, the human pack. Uh, that, that's all you need to do. Oh, the game is having a right panic attack, isn't it? Whoa, 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 whoa. Um, they were quite quiet on West Country. Now, the only thing is, if you want to add the voices, you had to do something else, and I didn't do that. I must admit, I was a bit lazy. Um, I just added the people, but I know you can add the voices as well. Um, but it, like I said, to me, even if they don't all have voices, for me, it's just nice to see some new faces. This environmental pack is getting uninstalled, though, I think. As much as I like it sometimes, this flickering is doing my nothing. Morning, sweetie. <laughs> he turned to a life of crime. Well, you're a pirate. You want to do the life of crime, though. Okay, I'll have a little look. I'll watch some videos. I'll, I'll YouTube it after this and have a little look. And Jesus, oh, Gavin, what the hell's going on with your driving? The only thing is, sometimes those games is the grind. It's very slow for content, but we'll see. If it looks alright, it'll be a bit of a laugh, then why not? Oh, is it? Oh, what, for this weekend? Okay, I'll definitely have a good look then. 
Yeah, so basically, because I've only been reloaded, I haven't reloaded in the bus properly in a while. The game, the game is dying. Basically, is what it's telling us. Normally, I go in and out of the depot, so Omzi reloads every time I do a run. I think it's two hours. As uh, said, Nat, no more, please. If anyone has epilepsy, I'd advise turning off the stream now. <laughs> Make my eyes even go funny. Yeah, Omzi needs to reload every little while, otherwise it gets memory leaks. Um, normally I'm in and out of different buses, so it's okay, but because I've been in the same bus all night, it's caused a bit of a problem. We don't have too far to go now. <clears throat> Is Richard okay in the office? Does anyone know? Is he surviving? Yeah, I'm going to pull this environmental pack out. It's, uh, it's not, not doing much for me. Like, I like the night skies and some of the rain is okay. It's a bit too wet sometimes, but... Yeah, this flickering is bloody annoying. Uh, Ralph Light Stream, thank you, mate. Much appreciated. Why would they release a DLC that does this? Like I said, normally most people do like a run for an hour max. So you're in and out of OMSI, it loads in and out. If you if I like reloaded in a new bus, it reload all the tiles because it's just kind of done the same thing all night long. I think it's what's causing it. Just a memory leak. But yeah, this is pretty rough. What I should have done is gone back to the depot Oh, Jesus, now someone's passed out. Freak's sake. Uh, Richard, mayday, mayday. Someone's passed out on my bus. I do want me to do what? Uh, someone's passed out. <laughs> I need an ambulance. Where to? Can you Where send to? it to... Uh, Blue Water Cove. Just find you first. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? There's his name. I'm down near the harbour on the left hand side. You want an ambulance? Yeah? Uh, yes, please. Oh, that's where it goes. That's where. To Blue Water Cove, yeah? Correct. Awesome. Thank you very much. What's up? <laughs> Ah, uh, he's a character. Will this bus come with Yorkshire 3 or is it separate? No, this is the bus that's coming with Yorkshire 3. Yeah. This is the bus you'll be getting. Epilepsy, maybe. <laughs> I like the way the lights have stopped now. The flickering is gone now that the lady's passed out. Yeah. I think I'm having a, a slight seizure here myself, to be honest with you. Uh, Fusion Distress has just passed us. I'm gonna give him a honk honk. <laughs> Hello. Hello, Hello, boss. I'm uh, oh, feedback. Um, I'm ready when you are. Slap me with whatever you got, please. Uh, real Essex, let me find you. Oh. You might have to first Essex, there we go. Not sure. Anything? Anything at all. Anything in it. Uh. Right, I'll the harbour. There we go. That'll do. Thank you very much, Buster. 
No worries. Bye. Bye. Okay, we've got two minutes to wait. It's gonna be a long two minutes. She probably did pass out from the from the lighting. I, I wouldn't be surprised to be fair. <laughs> that was a bit rough. Hey, Ralph, I'm doing good, mate. How are you? <laughs> She's one of those ladies that falls over on purpose looking for an insurance claim for dodgy driving. You do get them, believe it or not. Uh, Glenn Dixie, good evening. Are you streaming tonight, Glenn? What are you doing? Uh, First Smith, hello, yo. We're just waiting for our ambulance. Poor Doris, she fell over. Have you ever had a passenger pass out on your bus in real life? Um, not pass out as such. I've had, had some that have required like medical assistance and stuff. Um, and no one's really passed out. I do have some friends that have had some like, you know, people have died on the bus and stuff like that. Like it's, it does happen unfortunately. Oh yeah, I saw there was a new update for that. They didn't, they changed the, the career mode. Any time people fall over or pass out, generally it's like drunk kids and stuff. They fall down like skittles when you press the brakes when they're dancing on the top deck. That's generally the only time people fall over. It's the great thing of having a camera. They think they're all great banging and stumping above your head all night. So once once they once they start dancing about and prancing and you know slam on the brakes, God, this bus is not happy. Air ambulance, well. Wow. Yeah, thing, things things do happen. I should break it, poor Doris. Uh, have you ever hit a low bridge before? No, I'm not. I'm. Not, I, I know the size of my buses. I I know not to do stupid stuff. I generally drive coaches these days. I don't drive the uh, city stuff much, so. There's not that many low bridges for me to worry about. I've got set routes, so. The worst time is when you go on diversions and you get a bit lost. That's the only time you have to worry a bit.
then he needs to get back to work. No, I've been signed off till January now. Uh, so it would be in the new year. I reckon if I was to have a guess, maybe April, May, maybe. It all depends. There's a lot going on. There's a lot more complications than just the injuries. Um, there's a lot of, lot of hoops that I have to jump to make sure that I'm fit to drive passengers again. They're very strict here. So, um, yeah, there's a lot of things I need to do. Uh, I'm doing everything they tell me to do, so I'm doing everything I need to do right now. And then hopefully uh, they'll get me back at some point. Can't do too much more than that. So you got me for a little bit longer. Uh, can you do the bendy bus, please? Uh, I don't think I have the bendy bus installed. Not on right-hand drive, anyway. So I don't think I have that Sataro thing. Uh, this is actually our last route of the evening now. I'm going to go and... Uh, uh, yeah, look, it, it is what it is. You know, not much I can do. So... Just enjoy the time that I have. And, you know, I probably won't get this kind of time off again. So, yeah. Okay. Another perfect driving score. God, my averages have been terrible tonight. Not being any good driving. Okay, let's go back to the office then. And uh, I think I'm going to be sitting in the office for a little bit now. Uh, you're on sick too, mate. Yeah, it's... Bit crap. I was in a pretty bad car accident there uh, over a year ago, nearly now. Is this bus out yet? No, not out yet. It will be out when Yorkshire 3 is released, uh, which hopefully will be sometime soon. My channel has benefited, yeah, of course, because obviously I've been able to stream and I've got time to play games a bit more. <clears throat> so, yeah, I'm, I'm quite lucky in that respect. Um... So we see how we're doing. Is there many people still driving? What have we got going on? Uh, Fusion Distress is still out. Amy Lou is still out. Jonathan Holmes is out. Anyone else still out? Uh, Mac and BDOT. Nice. Okay, look, 101 grand today so far. That's a, it's a good result. Um, people are still driving for the next uh, little bit, which is also good. Uh, can't wait to get back. Yeah, it's getting to that point now as well. It's just... I'm just getting there. <laughs> um, but yeah, look, you know, I can't complain. The channel has benefited and I've enjoyed doing this as well. Like I when I go back with the buses because of the how the shifts work, like obviously I won't be as frequent with streams and videos and uh, so that kind of thing that make me a bit sad because I've actually really enjoyed this. It's a shame that you can't make good money on it. Um I'd love to be able to sit at home and do this every day, but you know, that's not realistic. It's not gonna happen. So yeah, things will have to change in the future for sure. <laughs> Um, but look, guys, thank you all very much for this evening. Thank you to everyone that joined in on uh, the actual event. I mean, there was quite a few people that have disappeared now. Uh, thank you to uh, Stephen for sitting in the office this evening and Father Jack for his first time, which is really cool. Uh, thank you to all the mods members in the chat. Thank you to Superb Media for becoming a new member as well. Enjoy the CCS element, to be honest. Even sat here watching the office stuff, not going to lie. Yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's nice, the CCS stuff. You can come do the office for us anytime, Sila. You're more than welcome. We're always looking for people to do the office. <laughs> uh, you're always more than welcome. Always more than welcome. Um, apparently, there's an ambulance up here for some reason. Who the hell is that for? Hey-ho, hey-ho. Um, 
pretty fun if you like controlling yeah um, look it's, it's pretty simple up here some people like to watch tv and chill like some drivers don't always want to drive so we, we kind of swap out hours and things like that um and all that kind of stuff so yeah it's pretty cool so yeah so sunday we will be flying there will be a group flight on vatsim on sunday night uh, and i plan to be back on yorkshire 3 on monday okay so we'll be doing some more yorkshire 3 on monday uh, so hopefully i'll see a lot of you guys then and uh, like I said, thank you to Kevin, uh, Ron for Transport, Dinners, Bus, Sila for being around as well, much appreciated. Uh, Kelly Edwards, Steve, Sean Maxwell, Commander Anderson, Glenn B, Zane, Daniela Long, uh, DRB, uh, Jesus, Mike Ray, DRB again, why not? Because that's who I saw. Glenn Bixley's now streaming himself. Uh, Solutions, LR Gaming. Uh, there's so many of you guys so many of you guys uh your support is fantastic as always marcus Doncaster as well um kevin graham thank you all very much and i will see you sunday evening bye for now